Okay guys, uh, long time no see. Uh, the purpose of this video is to do, it's, well, I have an unboxing. I've never done one of these videos before. I just received a new uh, tool for carving. It's a new carving axe. Uh, but actually the main purpose is to kind of mention that um, this uh, Robin Wood or Wood Tools axe that I recently purchased is actually for sale. Um, uh, but before um, we get into some very small details of the sale of this axe, I'll do a quick unboxing of what I received on my new chopping block here that I made recently. Just got this today. So I'm going to kind of show you why, um, not to show off, but just to kind of show you uh, why I'm selling this Robin Wood axe I just recently purchased. Um, so we'll kind of unbox this new axe here. Oops. Really dull blade here. Probably hear my dog running up and down the steps here. Okay. Try to make this as quick as possible. Get rid of all this bubble wrap, which I'll probably reuse. No, I won't reuse it. Cool. All right. So what we have here is a Hans or Hans Carlson uh, carving axe. Comes with the sheath. Uh, as most of you guys know, these things are not cheap at all. So this is, uh, oh wow, handle feels really good. Oh yeah, this is nice. So let's undo this. Ooh, mama. That's nice. Hopefully you guys can see this here. So there's my new carving axe. Put the little stamp there. Um, that's a beautiful, wow, it's amazing. It's a beautiful axe. Can't wait to use this thing. Um, damn, that thing is sharp. Crap. Oh, man. Yikes. <laughs> Scary. Scary sharp. Um, so there's my new carving axe. And there's the sheath. Nice little sheath that comes with it, as it should, for as much as uh, these things cost. Put this back. There we go. Okay, cool. Wow. Really nice. I can see how I'm going to like this a lot. So this is kind of like the uh, Rolls Royce, if you will, of carving axes. Dare I say... Better than the Nick Westerman, I guess, in a way, uh, or coveted, I guess. So it brings me to this. Um, I recently purchased this Robin Wood's Robin Wood uh, axe, and I understand it's a no frills axe, um, and it's kind of more for um, not beginner carvers, but it's kind of like uh, what I feel is kind of like the first kind of. Uh, uh, slightly, not expensive, but I guess uh, an axe that's more designed for carving that you can get for cheaper than like an eBay axe, like a camp hatchet, like is what, which is what I've been using um, for the past few years. Um, I wasn't happy with the overall quality of this axe. Uh, if you saw my Instagram post, I kind of mentioned about some gap there and a little bit of a nick in the blade. Uh, that being said... I still feel it's a good carving axe for someone um, if they... Come here, Lau. What's the matter, buddy? What's the matter? Come here. Come here. My dog's getting all upset because he wants to come over here. Come here. Come on. Come underneath. Come on, buddy. All right. So I do feel that this is a good axe for someone that is uh, just starting out to uh, carving. I have used this a bunch of times to carve uh, some spoons, and I feel that, you know, it's it's pretty decent. Uh, it It's... Definitely different than the um, kind of the camp hatchet that I've been using, um, and I've become very comfortable with this um, over the years, and it, it served me well, and it actually it will continue to serve me well. Um, so anyway, long story short, I'm going to be offering this for uh, fifty dollars um, shipped, free shipping within the U.S. It'll come with the sheath. If you were to buy this from uh, 
Robin's store with the axe, the axe, the sheath, and including the shipping, uh, it's going to cost you, I think I paid like $100 or more. Um, and that's shipped to the U.S. The shipping is like 20 pounds. So that's, you know, close to 30 bucks in the shipping, I believe. That's what I paid anyway. Um, I can get the exact specs if you want. So anyway, it's 50 bucks. Only shipping within the U.S. Um, if you want it, just uh, uh, comment below. Send me an email um, or, or rather a message through Instagram and I'll uh, put this up on my Etsy store. Um, and I'll even include a free spoon with this as well, like a, like a cooking spoon or something. Come on, buddy. Come on. Get my dog. Come on, bud. Let's go. Come on. I know he's a little nervous. What's he doing? He's afraid he's going to fall. Um, so just some, uh, thoughts really quickly on, you know, I just purchased this maybe like a month ago and why did I decide to purchase the, the, uh, Hans Carlson axe? Well, you know, at this stage, uh, for my carving, I, I would rather just spend a lot of money on the finest tools that you can get. So, which is a, you know, example or reason why I have a lot of Nick Westerman tools. Um, there are some others that I want to get as well from uh, Reed Schwartz and uh, some others that are in the U.S. that are making some, uh, which appear to be some really fine uh, quality uh, stop carving knives and uh, hook knives. So, this is, is not like a high, this Robin Wood Axe is not a, um, a high-end axe. I'll just kind of show you guys. Um, so it has, I'm going to sharpen this before, uh, it's it shipped and sold and everything. Um, but this, uh, I, I, you know, again, admittedly, it's not, um, you know, the highest quality, but again, that being said, I do feel it's a good ax for someone that is, um, getting into carving and wants an ax that's, uh, you know, specifically designed for carving. Um, so this is for sale. If you want it, it's yours. Just contact me through Instagram. Uh, just search at the Bearded Carver and uh, send me a DM and uh, let me know you're interested. And I'll put it up on my Etsy store. And you can purchase it. Like I said, 50 bucks, free shipping. And it will also include uh, a, uh, we'll say free, I guess, courtesy <laughs> um, spoon uh, with this as well. So um, that's all we got. And uh, thanks for tuning in. I just thought I'd put this out there really quick. It's kind of a, more of an impromptu kind of video. And I do promise again that I will be getting back to some carving videos for those that are interested. Um, and uh, we'll leave it at that. Okay? Uh, see you guys soon. Thanks so much.